Who decides these things? Rocco was, know. he was teaching me that before we arrived here. <laughs> I think it was more just to keep Gish entertained more than he needs to. Yeah. <laughs> They're all magnificent animals. I enjoy when there's a dominant male chasing a, a younger male, youngsters. bites him right in the butt, wow. <laughs> chases him around, bites him, bites him, bites him. You feel bad for the little guy. That's, that's what I tell a lot of people when they say, oh, when you see a zebra without a tail, and, oh, a lion. Yeah. They like biting each other's tails off. Wow. <laughs> Why do they do it? It's, it's just the dominance display or while they're fighting and, and the one runs away, that's the only thing you can get a hold of. So how can you tell here which one's a male, female? Um, this one's a stallion, that one's a female, that what, one's a female. How, how can you tell? I look at the chest. Um, I actually read it in the hunting magazine the other day. Uh, a male's got a flatter chest and the female's got a bit of a, a, bit of a concave. Oh. It, but it takes practice to see it. Sometimes also just by size, but that also takes a couple of, a, a bit of practice. Just by size you can right. see whether it's a stallion or a male. Well, you're a male. <laughs> <laughs>